Well, hello and welcome back. This is Carlos Cavallo from DatingAdviceGuru.com. Today we're going to talk about something that is very powerful. You might even call it kind of a, I don't know, maybe a magical spell. It's how to make a man fall in love with you. A little scientific discovery. And it's been the goal since the beginning of recorded time. We're creating a love potion, a spell, or any kind of magical method to make a man fall in love. And to be honest, men look for this too. Do you remember this little song? I told her that I was a flop with chicks. I've been this way since 1956. She looked at my palm and she made a magic sign. She said what you need is love potion number nine. Yeah, that little ditty is about a guy who wants that magic power. The power to make another person, your beloved, fall in love with you. Well, the truth is that you have that power in your right now, and you don't need no potion, baby, but there is a formula. I'm going to show you some of those steps right now. Make him fall for you, strategy number one, dial into his inner hero. A man wants to be your hero, probably more than anything else in the whole world. When a little girl is dreaming of having their knight in shining armor come to rescue them, men are dreaming of being that knight. And this is where many women sabotage themselves when it comes to love. Some insecurity or desperation or even loneliness makes a woman lower her standards for a guy. She winds up with an improvement project instead of what she really wanted. And then a certain amount of bitterness creeps in and she knows she deserves more than this. You have to let him bring out that part of him. No matter how small, he's got to be your hero. He doesn't have to take on a fire-breathing dragon, but he does have to have the opportunity to feel like he did. Because that's what a man needs, to feel masculine. Every bit as much as you need to feel feminine. Okay, get him to fall crazy in love with you. Strategy number two, be grateful and accepting. This is another symptom of settling when you choose a man. It's something that guys do just as much as women, by the way. When you settle for someone just because you feel an emptiness or loneliness in your life that needs filling, you're really vulnerable to choosing a guy that isn't a good fit. And again, it's easy to go down that road of bitterness. But when a woman is grateful for her man and she accepts him just as he is, she will encounter a whole different kind of man. He's the one that will smell that spark of appreciation and want it to erupt into a wildfire of connection. Woo, wildfire connection, that's pretty potent. You see, I've studied men, women, and relationships for over half my life. There's very little I can't solve when it comes to relationship problems. However, when you switch your, mind, your mindset over to acceptance and gratitude, you no longer have any problems. And this week, make it a point to celebrate one thing about your man, no matter how small. Tell him about it, and then watch his back straighten up and his pride bubble up from within. His face will light up with love. All right, make a man fall for you. Strategy number three, nurture the out of him. A man leaves his mom, well, we hope, around the age of 18 or so. Okay, let's say 20 or 25 if he's a millennial. And then for the rest of his life, he longs for that nurturing again, if he got healthy nurturing in the first place, that is. And if he's lucky, he finds a woman who will give a little bit of that nurturing to him. See, many women often start a relationship with that nurturing in place, perhaps maybe a little bit too soon. She gets a tentatively positive response from him and then she keeps going. But when that evil feeling of entitlement shows up again, it's hard to keep up, right? It's hard to keep up that act. But you gotta, you gotta keep him feeling that sense of nurturing and loving presence. It's what he wants in order to fall in love with you. And because he wants it for his children. Yeah, he is thinking ahead to that. Just strike a balance with your nurturing. Give him that feminine goddess presence and then give him some space to appreciate it when it comes around again. Men fall in love with the rhythm of love as much as the persistence of it. Ooh, that's deep. All right, how he falls in love, strategy number four, relax. Yeah, right about now I'm thinking about that Frankie Goes to Hollywood song, Relax. It's the complete opposite of what you'll want to do when a guy inevitably pulls back a little bit from your relationship. You'll probably panic just a bit and want to lean back into the relationship. And that's okay, but don't let it become a big stressful deal between you or a habit. That's a man's first warning, by the way, that you're insecure. It's when you're leaning back in like that. And when you show him you're insecure about love, he just knows you're going to open up your big bag of crazy on him at some point. Now, let me be clear about this. We don't mind it. We kind of expect it. But you have to keep your ratio of crazy to relax down. Like one crazy for every five relax. That's a good ratio to start it out. Take it easy on yourself and the relationship, okay? Yes, you got to have your life together, woman. Men believe in women that believe in their own lives. Make a man fall for you. Strategy number five, be irresistible. I'm going to tell you right up front, 
I created a love system for women called Irresistible Desire. I created it because I know beyond a shadow of a doubt that every woman wants this power to captivate her man, to make him desire her more than almost anything else. A truly irresistible woman has power over men. You have the power to make him obsessed with you, the power to make him live up to his potential, the power to make a relationship he never doubts or betrays or wants to walk away from. Really, the power to make him fall in love with you. Being irresistible to a man is simple when you know how men think. Just for a second, I want you to close your eyes and I want you to imagine the man of your dreams. Picture him in your mind right now, all the details of it. Maybe it's a guy you already know and you already have a crush on. Maybe it's a guy you want to win back into your life. He's your dream man, the kind of man that you can see yourself with for the rest of your life. Now imagine his eyes, the feel of his warm, safe arms wrapped around you, the smell of his skin next to you. You got that sensation? Okay, now here's the question. If this dream guy was here in front of you right now, would you know what he needs from you to let himself fall completely in love with you? If you do, fantastic. But then I gotta ask you, why haven't you gone and gotten that guy yet? And if you don't know what to do to get this guy to fall in love with you, well, let me show you. There's a way to get him to feel that kind of irresistible desire for you. I've got a little report for you, it's something you can read really quickly and discover the truth about this little known fact of how men feel desire for women. Just click that little link you see down below this video, top part of the description. And of course, do the big three. You gotta like this video, you gotta subscribe so you keep getting this awesome goodness that I'm giving out to you. And of course, leave me your questions and comments below. Delightfully entertaining no matter what. This is Carlos Cavallo from DatingAdviceGuru.com. As always, live and love with passion.